Hi, this is Jay-Z. Series now, mobile learning sessions for Paris release and mobile resources. Today, I'm going to focus on three topics. Series now, mobile journey. Top six new mobile features in Paris release. Last one will be mobile resources. Before I start, I'd like to introduce two of my newcoming service learning channels. First one is ServiceNow Development Channel, which contains 12 learning videos how to build your ServiceNow customer application. You should learn all types of scripting and how to build your own applications. Second one is ServiceNow Application Configurations. There are seven topics start from HR service delivery to security instance. Each topic contained subcategory like ITSAM. You may have three classes, for example, one for instance, one for problem, one for change request. Both learning sessions will be started on coming weeks. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel for coming videos. Let's start. Number one, ServiceNow Mobile Journey. ServiceNow set mobile classic since 2017 on Helsinki release. Users can access most ServiceNow out of box applications through your mobile browsers. Two years later, 2019, ServiceNow released mobile agent on Madrid release for IT application support. The same year, 2019, ServiceNow released no mobile application on New York, released for business support. Is employee application we call. On this year, press release, the advanced security features has been implemented. I will present more detail of a new feature in late slides. Quebec will mainly focus on native innovation will come next year. Both agent and no app can be free download from your cell phone. Mobile agent is mainly focused on IT support applications, which can be used to update record, coordinate with your coworkers, track your location, and work without internet connections. Agent mobile applications support instance and other applications like event, security instance, and customer service or others. No mobile application is for business application like HR on the top. In addition, HR onboarding. In addition, ServiceNow added safe workplace mobile application due to COVID-19 pandemic. And you can see like employee readiness survey and employee health screening, workplace PPE inventory management application have been added to mobiles. The following are out-of-box applications in Paris. In the agent, you can see the application from ATSAN to CSM, ATBM, ITOM. In no mobile, you can see the safe place applications. You can read long list here. In addition, ATBM for timesheet, and HR employee onboarding, and HR com campaigns. Let's begin my second topic, top six mobile new features in Paris release. This is first one, mobile security. This is number one important feature on this release, especially for US government clients. Paris release has added two new security features. Let's look at the first one, mobile edge equipments. User can view and edit equipment data 
all configuration settings are performed in a web-based UI. You can see here. Each encryption equips sensitive data on your company premises before sending over internet. It equips this data from front end and back end in the data record. This feature is very important for HR information, especially PPA data. Second feature is government cloud, we call Gov Community Cloud. Some mobile applications are authorized to use within Gov Community Cloud, but they have strong security uh, compliance requirement. You know, like piece 142 valid encryption when you connect to Gov Community Cloud instance. Local stored application data, it must be like, you know, user preference. Offline data must be equipped. Service so not meet all the compliance and security for government cloud, that would be really useful for government client to access the sensitive data from personal mobile applications. Number two, campaign on mobile. Campaigns delivery proactive, scheduled, and targeted message to enhance service delivery experience. Our HR clients are very happy to learn this feature because they can use campaign to deliver messages, important information to their users, interact with promotional display by either review videos, be redirect to web pages. I have list some use cases here. You can start from health alert and to go to different like an uh, open environment and all information can be used campaigns. It's very useful. You can create a three type campaign card. Like so this is like image card. This is text card. This is video card for campaigns. This is really flexible. You can tag it in different audience. Number three, mobile notification. In Paris release, the new setting feature has been added for notification preferences. Any user can easily configure publish notifications. User, user notification can control push notification they receive it on their mobile device. Push notification are organized into category is on this window. This is a category. When you use a click category, you have list setting for push notification. You can either disable or enable notification by yourself. There are two notification you can on this release, one is called no action request. That most application belong to this type. Another one is action request with approval, reject notification. You can easily approve, reject your either task through notification without logging source on instance. I really like the feature. This feature has been used for backend application for a long time, but this is the first time we bring over to mobile applications. Number four, mobile filter enhancement for items and location. The filtering capability extend for list and map applets, increase ability for users to search. In the applet, they have filter feature have added here. You can enable add filter. Filter default have more default filter have opened here. You can add additional filter for your own purpose. In the mobile, we have filter. You can add different search criteria for yourself. 
This is very useful for end users. Number five, copy applet. Use Studio to create a copy of a list or employ a dictionary applet. This feature will really help mobile developer to save the time to create a new applet. This HRK's applet I created. You can see you have made a copy your action button. When you click this button, then you can see new window pump up ask you app name. You just simply add new app name, click save. Then new app will be copied from existing one. Number six, disable classic mobile applications. As default, ServiceNow disable ServiceNow mobile classic on your instance. However, user can use your mobile classic if you enable your classic mobile system property at least here. And usually on the default, you can't, it's locked but you still can unlock and this system property to review your classic applications. Last topic, the mobile resources. In this section, I like to provide all possible mobile resources for you so you can learn more about service on mobiles, especially how to build mobile applications. Let's look at mobile application architect design. And understand mobile architect design is a very important step to learn how to create mobile applications. We know ServiceNow have mobile app in the studios. You, in the studio, you have all these structures start from navigation bar, on the navigation bar, it contains all the navigation bar tabs. On the navigation tabs, you have applet, the one I can present you early. You have applet launchers. This is very important too, to build your noble applications. In on the applet, you have list, map, you know, calendar, form, browser. This applet most like a form in the back end. In applet launcher, you have header, global search, you have action or other features. Understand overall structure. It's really help you when you start build mobile applications. I have summarized all the resources I use to learn certain mobiles. I hope they can help you. You can start from mobile tutorials. They have detailed information about each release mobile applications in details. I really recommend to start from here. Then look at a mobile agent and no mobile applications. This, this is a video I have posted in YouTube by ServiceNow. It's easy for you to re look at and after you look at the mobile tutorials. And one, I would like to introduce you one very good mobile learning channel from ServiceNow highlight in yellow. The getting start with ServiceNow Agent Mobile. Getting start with ServiceNow Agent Mobile contains 11 videos. You can learn Agent mobile from basic to how to build a mobile application step by step. It's created by ServiceNow team. You should be able to create your mobile application by watching those videos. This is really my favorite channel. I strongly recommend you to look at all videos for your ServiceNow mobile learnings. covered three topics, ServiceNow mobile journey from classic to no mobiles.
Top six mobile new feature in Paris release. Mobile resource review. As I mentioned earlier, I'm going to open two new ServiceNow learning channels. ServiceNow developer channel and ServiceNow configuration channel. After this video, please click subscribe button for my coming learning session videos. Thank you for watching.